WCAX Channel 2 Sports, sponsored by Xfinity Mobile. After a season opening loss Thursday at BU, the UVM women's soccer team returned to Virtue Field Sunday for the first Catamount home contest of the 2023-24 school year. Rally and the Cats welcoming in the Merrimack Warriors for a matinee this afternoon. And Vermont would be tested on early in this one. Seventh minute, Warriors on the attack. Molly Murnane lines one up from outside the box. But Aaron Murphy up to the task, pushing it over the bar, keeping the game scoreless. It wouldn't take long for Vermont to change that, though. 27th minute, Abby Noble, great move to get around her defender. Into the box, cross skips by Kate Bossert. But Alyssa Oviedo there to pounce on it. First goal of the season for UVM. They lead it 1-0. Before the break, Merrimack would pull one back. Great long ball from Sydney Haskin into Isabella Keogh. She will sprint by the Vermont back line, sneak it past Murphy. This game level 1-1 at the break. Second half, though, well, that would belong to the Catamount. 67th minute now. It's Aubrey Bow on the corner. She finds Maddie Cronin. She'll settle it, then fire it home. The go-ahead tally to set Vermont up nicely in that second half. The play of the game would come just eight minutes after that. Bailey Ayer, she's going to try to whip across into the box. She finds a warrior head instead, but check out the second effort by Ayer getting in there to chip one by the keeper. Bailey Ayer, the insurance goal in the 75th minute. Bossert would then put this one on ice two minutes later. A rip-roaring 4-1 win for Vermont. Their first victory since October 5th of last year. And that should do wonders for their confidence going forward. Um, yeah, no, after BU, we had a super tough game. I was really proud of our team hit there, and I was really proud of the way that we came out after. They ended up tying it one-to-one, -one how we responded to that, and I think that it was, we did everything that we could, and it showed, really. Yeah, it was great. I think, you know, it was a little bit of a, a tough year for us last year with some pretty close one-goal losses. Um, so for this group to be able to step out and, and have a kind of a commanding win um, was really needed and especially nice at home.